Hey everyone! Dive into today's trivia challenge and test your knowledge. Ready? Let's get started! Did you know there's an animal that can catch up on sleep for almost three years? Which one? Snail In which movie would you find the character, Jack Dawson? Titanic I was reading about tiny countries the other day. Do you know which one holds the title for the smallest in the world? Vatican City Speaking of iconic movie roles, who starred as Neo in The Matrix? Keanu Reeves Let's talk about beverages. Among Coca-Cola, Pepsi, Dr. Pepper and Red Bull, which one wasn't originally introduced as a beverage? Red Bull Trailblazing women in history, can you name the first woman who snagged a Nobel Prize back in 1903? Madame Curie Ever dreamed of visiting the Emerald Isle? Do you know which place I'm referring to? Ireland An interesting fact, adults have fewer bones than babies. How many bones does an adult human have, anyway? 206. If you had to dive into the world's deepest ocean, which one would it be? Pacific. Which bird is associated with delivering babies? Do you know that? Stork. Shakespeare had some iconic lines. Where did he write, to be or not to be, that is the question. Hamlet Colors on flags represent so much. Do you know which color is predominant, being on around 75% of the world's flags? Red Everyone loves ice cream, right? But which country do we have to thank for inventing it? China Islands can be massive too. Do you know the world's largest island? Greenland if you ever come across a Geiger counter, do you know what it's used to measure? Radiation Nature's got talent. Which bird is famed for its stunning tail and a dance that's hard to forget? Peacock Some mountain peaks get you closer to space than others. Which one takes the top spot? Chimborazo The cosmos has some intriguing names. Which planet got its title from the Roman god of war? Mars People often get this wrong, but can you name the capital of Australia? Canberra There's a vital organ responsible for removing waste from our blood. Any idea which one? Kidneys 
Remember that buoyancy experiment in school? Who's the genius behind that principle? Archimedes Spanish, Italian, and other languages. What's the primary language spoken in Brazil? Portuguese Fashion capitals are a big deal. New York, Paris, Milan and Los Angeles but which city doesn't fit the list? Los Angeles Statue of Liberty, a symbol of freedom. But do you know which country gifted it to the USA? France Music lovers, here's one for you. Which instrument is regally known as the King of Instruments? Organ Dinosaurs have always fascinated us. Can you name the author of Jurassic Park? Michael Crichton There's only one queen of pop from the 1980s. Who comes to mind? Madonna. If we were sipping a mojito right now, which country should we be toasting to for its origin? Cuba. Which company did Steve Jobs co-found? Apple Health check. Which vitamin is crucial when you get a cut, helping your blood clot? Vitamin K Groovy beats and Caribbean vibes. What musical genre from the late 60s in Jamaica are we talking about? Reggae. Who's the mastermind behind the theory of relativity? Albert Einstein. Indiana Jones fans might know this. Where's the ancient city of Petra located? Jordan Olympics are always thrilling. Which country played host in the summer of 2016? Brazil Continents have dividers. Which mountain range serves as a boundary between Europe and Asia? The Ural Mountains. In which country is the city of Casablanca located? There's a musical sound distinctively Scottish. Which instrument am I thinking of? Bagpipes. If we were in the city of love, where would we be right now? Paris. Big, majestic, and herbivorous. What's the largest type of deer we can find? Moose or elk in Europe. Nature has its own version of indestructibility. What's the hardest natural substance on Earth? Diamond. Bonus. Picture a grand mosque with beautiful blue tiles. Where in Europe would you travel to see it? 
That's it for today's trivia. How'd you do? Don't forget to hit like if you enjoyed and subscribe for more quizzes. Thanks for watching.